Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Happy Saturday. Yes. How's everyone doing today? You see, it's only two of us in the car today, so. <laughs> we miss you, Dominic. How you doing, Bryce? I am fantastic. You know, it's a beautiful day today. Yes, we got coffee today. Well, you got some coffee today yes. from, where we go? Uh, Dunkin' Donuts? Dunkin' Donuts. I got a caramel craze caramel latte. I got a little. A tongue twister for you. I got a little pot right Nice. Blue. Little Martin Bear Blast. Nothing too crazy. Nothing no. too crazy. No, no. What are we driving in today? This is a 2020 Mercedes. Mm -hmm. What? GLE? E Formatic or something like that? No, 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 no. This, what what is, is this? Please, please inform the people. I'm pretty sure this is the 2020 GLE. GLE? Yes, sir. Nice. It's uh, really loaded as well, too, as far as what it actually comes mm -hmm. with. It's real nice. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I like the interior. But the major thing that we want to talk about today Ooh. is, yeah, he was going pretty quick. <laughs> <laughs> the major thing that we want to talk about mm -hmm. today is some of the topics that you guys, or some of the questions that you guys may have, you know, for us in mm -hmm. regards to Lexus. Yes. So Bryce, uh, what are some of the questions that So that may have? let's see. One of the big ones is what happened to the GS350? Ah, Okay. So that was a model that I believe came out in 2007. Mm -hmm. uh, they stopped producing it in 2020. Mm -hmm. The major reason why, and this is just um, a, a reason I believe on why they stopped doing the GS, mm -hmm. was because the ES350 F Sport came out. Correct. Um, the midsize sedan, you know, one of the best selling sedans. Mm -hmm. um, and so they stopped doing the GS mm -hmm. and just paid more attention to the ES350. That's one of the reasons why I believe they stopped doing it. Yeah, because they never had a F-Sport for the ES, which was right crazy. So when it did come out, it was pretty big. Um, right. But a right. lot of people do miss the GS, and I'm, I like the GS as well. That is true. They yes. definitely do. Um, let's see. The other question, are we making electric vehicles oh this is a question that everybody wants to know yes so yes uh we are um it's definitely in the making mm -hmm. um, the one of the models that started it all i would say will be the nx because we had came out with a plug-in yes um but more to come in the future um, you can see it on lexus.com they're coming out with the rz 450e mm -hmm. which is like a suv so yeah definitely definitely nice. uh, we can't and wait I, for that and i think i heard someone say maybe five to six years from now mm. every lexus model will have a hybrid version mm. so like an electric or correct oh wow okay nice correct so that's what i thought i heard and i looked it up and i seen something talking about it as well as everything every vehicle the is will be electric wow and full hybrid wow so that should be nice uh coming up soon and the way you know gas prices are right now <laughs> man electric wouldn't uh hurt at all exactly exactly yes especially with uh it's like you said gas prices but with for lexus to do in a fully electric vehicle you know they're going to do it right the first time amazing so yeah that's going to be exciting to see yes yes, um, yes but other than that we want more questions so leave your questions that you have for us in the comment section below Please. Um, have an awesome weekend and you know you can finish it off Bryce and you know come see us come come take a look at this 2020 GLE or we have new Lexus of course definitely we have pre-owned vehicles yes whatever it is we have them here so yeah come by see me or Charles or your favorite sales associate and we'll see you guys next week we'll see you next week